Okay, we have Eddie G versus Cosmos. Okay. Let's see how Cosmos deals with this matchup. Cosmos, yo. Looks like we've got a second commentator. Cosmos already playing a, a more awake than last set. We have not seen any mummy yawns. Having said that, this game is completely even considering kill percent for both of these characters. I would say I think Peach is one of the characters that has more tools than usual to avoid getting rollered, considering that she doesn't spend much time on the ground due to her float. Beautiful avoiding of all edge guards by Eddie. <coughs> yeah, Cosmos kind of playing more aggressively than Eddie was ready for, and that allowed him to finish that stock. Ooh, Cosmos knowing how to punish that choke pressure. That was impressive. Okay, Eddie finding forwarder. Ooh. I've seen him play Peach. I mean, we've all played this game not that long, right? So I would say it's fair to say since the beginning of this game. And he did play Peach in Smash 4. Yeah. And I think he was a Brawl Peach too. I'm not sure. But he definitely... This is not like a random character for him. Having said that, he's already down two stocks due to um, that incredible combo that Cosmos got. Okay. What do we have? Cosmos playing very safe at the ledge game. Not getting forward aired. Oh, and Roller does in fact seal the deal. Are you on? It says, I can't tell. No, I don't think you're on. Hey, can you guys uh, make sure that the second commentator is on? Hi there. Ah, oh, there, there we go. go. Okay. Where would you counterpick here? Um, against this character, mainly yeah. because of the play style involved. I would counterpick to a big stage like Pokemon Stadium 2. Maybe not Battlefield. Not Battlefield. Yeah, okay. I, I disagree with Battlefield. Mainly because Cosmos is showing that he's going to be the aggressor here. Mm. So if you see that your opponent is playing as the aggressor, you need more space to play your st particular game style. Gotcha. I'm not sure what Peach has here. Okay, he's already at the ledge. Over committed on that combo and immediately got punished. How do you feel about Inkling as an actual character on the tier list? I don't think they're that good. I mean, they're they're top tier, but I definitely don't think they're the best character. I think Peach is probably better. I feel that. I understand that a lot. I feel like they're a menace online. Oh yeah, of course. but for sure. On this, it's kind of hard to say. I that. think they're a light character that struggles to kill, mm -hmm. and. That means that they'll probably get punished by a character like Wario or, you know, even Donkey Kong. Really hard. Okay. Oh, Ooh, nice timing. That was that was lovely. I really don't know how he's gonna come back from that. We'll find out. Well, now now the stage is in his favor in the sense that if this was a big stage, he would be chasing forever. Oh, I understand. That's good. So now at least he doesn't have to chase. You know on PS2. Those back airs are beautiful. Oh, last time that happened, he got comboed off stage and died. Okay, this <laughs> is death. And... Eddie's kind of playing deer in headlights -y. Like, mm. he's capable of taking stocks off of Cosmos for sure, but just the amount of situations that Cosmos is putting him in, and also probably the pressure of the caliber of player involved. Right. Punish. Oh, you want to be cool. Good up smash, uh, but that up B was overextending to a different level. Well, he just wants to get the stock right now. You can tell. He's fishing. And I expect Cosmos to not let him. Yep. He, he just hasn't been able to get back on stage safely without taking salt. 
Ooh. Ooh. That could have been a harder punish, actually, I think. Ooh. Oh, uh, that's it. Oh. Yeah. I think if you're like a top player and you see that the other opponent is just, all they want is just to take the stock.